me again, Crazy Bag Lady. It's Monday morning and it's pouring with rain and I think it's going to rain all day. So last night I thought it would be a good idea to have some more wine to finish off some bits of wine. And yeah, I woke up in the middle of the night feeling like I was dead. I woke up this morning felt like I was dead and still pretty much look like I'm dead. I don't know how people can drink all the time. Like I've had a drink for two nights running and I literally feel like I am dead. <laughs> so I guess... I'm hungover, it's the word, oh my god, I just feel horrible, so anyway, I'm just about to put all my makeup on, but I thought I'd show you my face before, before my Avon makeup, show you how bloody good Avon makeup is, so this is me now, I feel so ill, Ooh, it's horrible, so let's see what Avon can do for me, this is it, before I'm a little bit more human. <laughs> so it works wonders to make you look a little bit more human. Right, so let's have a look at calendar of the day. So like I say, the weather's a bit, oh, it's not nice out there. So morning me, beautiful Flora, Pat Peggy and all my little Peggy friends, um, little Bubba bless him, little Freddie Flint's laugh and little Positive Potato. Big, big hugs everybody. We do say this every morning, but we are all here for each other with our mental health so big hugs if you are struggling i know days like this can be very depressing so try and do something cozy and nice if you can so i've already had my second cup of tea in me hey there beautiful mug uh right so calendar of the day oh look be amazing today well we will try <laughs> don't worry be happy we've got there's no time like the present and let's turn the radio down take a moment for baby yoda I think today is going to be a long day. Breakfast. So, breakfast this morning. I've got squash banana with Yeo Valley Organic Yogurt because Tesco sent the wrong one. I normally have the Onken one and they've sent this. I don't know whether I like this as much. It's a bit tangy. Um, right, anyway, so cornflakes with my friends. So, they very fancy the cornflakes this morning. So, there you go. There's one. There's two. Don't know where Dolly is. She couldn't tempt her with a cornflake. So, first thing we need to do is wash up, empty the dishwasher. Uh, we've got to go to the post office, fetch a pack of paper, and I'd like to put some of my autumn stuff out if I get a chance. Third cup of tea of the morning. Here we are. I've tried to be cheerful today, so I've got on a, a lilac fluffy cardigan. <sighs> it's going to be a long day. <laughs> <laughs> so next job I've just realised it's Ruby's birthday on Wednesday and I haven't packed any of her presents or wrapped them or anything so I thought right next job get Ruby's presents wrapped and then you know that's another thing done and how absolutely gorgeous is this wrapping paper I love it it's so bloody cheerful I've run out of wrapping paper <laughs> I've only got that tiny bit left and I've got two ghosts to wrap up um so this one was from the range I bought this one first he's a bit flat <laughs> bless him and this is the one from George Asda this one is absolutely gorgeous if I'd have bought this one first I wouldn't have bought that one but obviously I'd already bought that one so she's got two they're so cute look at them <laughs> but this is my favorite look how soft it is if you get the chance to get one from George Asda get one they're so cute, even if you get one for yourself. I just love it. And this is what Winifred thinks to the weather. <laughs> Snug as a bug in a rug. So, first load of washing done. And it's now under me heated area. I'm ho not holding out much hope to get James's massive jeans dry. <laughs> I haven't got a cover for it, so I've just chucked a sheet over it. Fingers crossed it dries them a little bit. Mm. Ten past twelve. So I've been on the phone to my mum for an hour. So it's ten past twelve. I'm just making myself some spaghetti hoops. So I'm going to have a bowl of spaghetti hoops. And then we really need to get going to the parcel shop and stuff. Well, I've eaten my spaghetti hoops and now I'm sat here. And Dolly's decided to make herself comfy on my knee. You can't make yourself comfy. I've got to go to the post office. I've got to go to the shop. I've got to take my cardigan back to Asda. And I really don't want to drive to Asda. That's so annoying. Because that one's a boring Asda. There's no 
clothes there or house rent stuff to look at or anything. So that's really boring. And we need to get some wrapping paper. We really need to get going. So I can't sit here with you on my knee. I'm very sorry. I would like to sit here. It's very warm and relaxing. <laughs> so the only person that's come for a little treat is Dolly. There you go. A bit of cheese for you, my dear. Lipstick of the day. So lipstick of the day say is feisty fawn so these are the new ones they're really nice um the avon power stay lip stylos feisty fawn love it so nice like such an autumn color it's lovely right we really need to get going i really don't want to i feel like death <laughs> right we're going to go and get some First parcel dropped off. Now I've got to walk to the post office um, and I need to get a couple bits for eBay. Let's go. Oh, this weather is revolting. <laughs> it's so gloomy. Bloody miserable day. I've probably said that a million times, but look at it. And it's raining again. There's like some sort of weird drizzle on the window screen. Right, quarter to two. One more parcel to drop off, and we're near Tesco as well. Let's go. It's absolutely peeing it down. And I went back twice because those little like flowers reduced to £1.80, which is actually cheaper than a bunch of flowers. So I bought my mum a pot, Pat a pot, and me a pot. <laughs> well, no, I didn't. I bought myself two pots, so I bought four. They were so cheap, £1.80. They were originally £4, so I thought, I'll get some of them. They're so nice. Um, and I've also bought Pat some more pyjamas because my mum really likes Pat as well. My mum like, oh, I'll treat her to some pyjamas. So we've got her another pair of pyjamas as well. So I'll take them around when we get back. So we need to go home. Look at the weather. I'm home. Looks like Florence has been busy while I've not been here. Look, trying to get uh, Dolly's food again. What's she been doing? I don't think Winifred's even moved. Dolly, Dolly, what's Florence been doing? Has she been trying to pinch your food? She's naughty, isn't she? 
Is she naughty? I don't even know where she is. She must have given up. Is she in there? So, it's only half past two. I can't believe how dark it is. Right, so I'm just going to quickly ring my mum, finish wrapping Ruby's presents, and then we'll go and see Pat. And also, I'm going to make myself a coffee. Ten to three. My mum wasn't in, so I couldn't speak to my mum. Um, so, a cup of coffee, and I've just had one of my neighbours ring up, not Pat, one of my other neighbours. She says, have you got like an oven-proof dish because I'm going to make you an apple crumble? Oh, bang goes the diet, but how adorable is that? And she was like, I'll make it for your tea, so I need to go really, but then I think I want my coffee, so we'll go in a minute. How sweet is right, that? I'm going now, so I'll leave the lid on my coffee. That'll keep my coffee warm. Let's go. Right, away we go. <laughs> I'm home. It's just turned into one of those days today. So I was on the way to my neighbours and then another neighbour started talking to me. So I was talking to him and his little pug for about 10 minutes. Then I went to my neighbours, I gave them the dish and she started to make the apple crumble straight away and then I couldn't, they were very busy talking to me. And it's now half a three and they've told me to come back at four o'clock and it'll be done. Bless them, it's so sweet. I was like, I can't thank you enough, it's so lovely. Um, and they've also sent me back with some apples for my mum because my mum likes to make apple crumble sometimes. Um, yeah, so I better drink my coffee. I've got to go back there at four, so I might nip to Pat's first before I go to their house again. And these are the pajamas that I got for Pat. They're so cute. Um, I think even I'd like some, they're adorable, bless them. Yeah, so you like them? Yeah? <laughs> Right, I've done Pat. Now I need to go back and fetch me a crumble. <laughs> right, I'm home. I can't cope with all the kindness. So, I went to my neighbour first and to drop the dish off and stuff. Then I went um, to Pat's. And then I got a new pyjamas on, a leopard ones, and she loves the other ones that were brought to her as well. And then she's given me this to give to my mum, because my mum treated her to the pyjamas, so she wanted me to give this brooch to my mum from Pat. And then I went back to my other neighbour to pick up the apple crumble, um, and then Pat would like a bit of the apple crumble as well, she's gonna have it for a tea. So in a bit, I've got to go back to Pat's again and give Pat a little bit of apple crumble. And then because my neighbours have made me the apple crumble, it was so kind, so, I gave her one of the pots of flowers that I bought earlier on. So I gave one of the pots to Pat, one of the pots to me other neighbours. And at the minute, I've got two little pots left. So I'm going to give one to me and one, one to me. I wasn't have two myself, but I've given one away now because they were just so kind. They were like, oh, you didn't need to get us anything. I was like, no, no, they were in the sale. I wanted to. So yeah, very excited to have a bit of apple crumble, but so much kindness in a little like neighbourhood is just so cute, isn't it? Oh, and Pat really liked the dinner. She did say the broccoli was a bit soggy. <laughs> I love how honest they are. It makes me laugh so much. She's like, mm, I didn't like the broccoli that much, but I said, yeah, but it was soft. You wanted it soft, um, so it was easier to swallow. She said, and the chicken were a bit spicy. I said, yeah, I know it was. But it's just, oh, it was beautiful. Loved it. <laughs> so it was beautiful. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, there is my tea. So I've got two chicken burgers. So they're different ones. They, these are Tesco ones because they didn't have the normal ones. Um, and Ruby had these ones last week, so they were delicious. So yeah, some pops chicken burgers and some little crisps. And then afterwards, we're gonna try the apple crumble. Oh, apple and blackberry crumble. Oh, my tea was lovely. And it's <coughs> vegan time for my friends. Right, Florence. No, that's not yours. Oh, Winifred. <coughs> Winifred! Here you go, darling. Here you go. And last but not least, Callie! Go! Don't run into the chair. Stay cage. What's naughty Florence been doing? Hey, what's she been doing? Oh, I've tried a little bit on spoon already. Absolutely delicious. I have to enjoy it. I've put cheeky bit of ice cream on mine. My husband's already eaten his. What do you think to it? Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh. I have to say, I think that was the nicest apple crumble I have ever had the pleasure of eating. It was absolutely delicious. Oh, it melted in your mouth. It was lovely. Oh, it was so nice, Dolly. <laughs> I think I'm in a food coma. It was so lovely. 
Why is that horrible thing on the sofa? Um, it was absolutely beautiful and we've already messaged, well, my husband messaged the neighbour and said, you know, thank you so much for that apple crumble. It was absolutely delicious. Like, yeah, no problems. I'll do you one again next week. <laughs> it's like, I'm trying to eat healthily and people keep giving me stuff like that and I have to eat it. <laughs> it was absolutely delicious. Anyway, my dears, so I'm going to love you and leave you. So many thanks for joining me again today. I hope you've enjoyed it. So if you do enjoy just a genuine bit of real life with its ups and downs and its highs and lows then please subscribe to my channel come and find me on instagram as mrs crazy bag lady uh, my little avon shop's down below it's all down below so i'll love you and leave you i'll see you tomorrow bye